Hello everybody and welcome back to Human Machines. Keep in mind this is a two-part video. We're talking all about working with a keg and training with odd objects. Now if you already have your keg and you're good to go, then you're all set. We're going to show you a bunch of exercises that you can jump right into. If not, you're going to want to refer back to part one where we teach you how to find a keg and basically get it ready for lifting. Now guys, why do you want to lift heavy odd objects? Why do you want to do this? Because if you're sticking with the barbells and the dumbbells in the gym, those things all have the same center of gravity. It's easy to find. You're going to build the same muscles, but when you're training with something like a keg, live weight, and it's sloshing around, that's going to awaken all these stabilizer muscles that you probably never hit in your life. I'm just assuming, you know, worst case scenario. So let's jump right into it, guys. Here we go. When working with a keg, you first must humble yourself. The clean and press is challenging enough when using a barbell. Now, try doing it with your keg for a more challenging experience. To prepare yourself for the clean and press, or if you found it too difficult, try the mixed grip press. This will minimize the sloshing effect of the water inside. And if you're ready to focus on explosive power in your hips, glutes, and core, try the Viper Press. Shouldering the keg can be compared to deadlifting, but with the added dynamic of stabilizing the keg at the top, make sure you give equal attention to both sides. Use your keg to replace traditional moves like the bent over row and the lateral raise. And if you're still interested in grip work, you can do a barrel roll. You can also take your keg the distance with a number of keg carries. And now that you own a keg, it's time to get creative. Slam that bitch. Roll that shit. And throw that fucker. All right guys, thank you for watching the video. We hope you enjoyed some of these exercises that you can do with your new keg. You know, to be honest, having this keg to train with is such a great investment. It's a solid tool, it's gonna last you a lifetime. You could even hand this thing down to your grandkids and show them how a real man trains for strength. Guys, if you like the video, hit the thumbs up down there. If you have something to say, leave it in the comment section below. And if you watch our videos every week, why the heck haven't you subscribed yet? We'll see you next time.